Nice boots. This is the emergency broadcast system. This is not a test. Repeat, this is not a test. Stay tuned for further It seems like it's been forever, but we're back. The Mystic Museum. It's that time of year where we come to Southern California to look at creepy things. Look at that creepy thing. 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 Ah! There's a whole wash tub full of creepy things. Do we know who he is? I forget who he is. The who? The collector? Is that who he is? If you guys know who he is, let me know. I think Lindsay says she thinks he's he's the collector. I don't, I don't know. Coraline's father. Coraline's father. That's what Alex says. <laughs> I know, but he has interesting stuff in his hands here. And the design of the shop has completely changed. I freaking love it. Am I supposed to put both hands here? Would you like to put both hands here? No. There you go. That might be something Otherwise. else. I have to line my hand up with it. Hmm. Yes. I guess Rosie and I are doing this couples thing. All right, there's my hand. What are we supposed to do? Just leave it here? Yeah. Are we getting electrocuted? My hands are on there. Zoltar speaks. A new romance is not for you. No, because you're stuck with the one you got. <laughs> <laughs> if you haven't caught any of my other videos that I've done at the Mystic Museum, it is an oddity store in Burbank, California. And we come here every year when we do the Midsummer Scream. But this is one of our favorite oddity stores. If it's not, it is pretty much my favorite oddity store that I've ever been to. And, um, Every year they seem to have something new in it. They have a new design in here now. We're gonna see if they got a new display inside the museum. We're gonna walk through the store and see what they got. Just absolutely love the decor of this place. And of course, they have the best Zoltar machines here. Jigsaw. They have this 12 foot skeleton in here that they have every year when we come here. I love the way that they made it look old and. Like it's got decay on it and spider webs and it's just cool. I mean, they've even painted in like, like there's still some tendons left. There's some rotting tendons in there and this uh, skin still hanging on. All right, so this is a real skeleton that was donated to a college. I don't know how many years ago. Um, I do a whole thing about this on one of the other videos. But it's $800 for the coffin, it's $4,500 for the skeleton, it's $5,000 for the whole set. I wanna say this is over 100 years old, but it is literally a real skeleton. And you can tell when, when they're donated how they, how they have them all put together still. I'm not gonna touch anything. Who doesn't want a giant frame full of bugs? You know you want it. Aliens. How'd you like to wake up with this thing crawling up your leg? Today's museum exhibit is Horror High School Reunion. So it's all high school horror movies. Sounds like fun. I know that this is supposed to be Paris Hilton. I don't really think it looks like her, but that's supposed to be her from Wax Museum. This is Sam. I'm Unfortunately, he's not for sale because <laughs> I would, I would, oh yeah, he would, no, he'd be at the front door. I'd just use him to scare people away from the house. That's just amazing. Let me show you how big he is. Just for scale, this is Sam. Probably not supposed to touch him. He's hella cool. If you've never seen the movie Trick or Treat, this is what Sam looks like without the mask on. This Sam is actually for sale. So this Sam is $3,000. It is a spot on exact image of him in the movie. Creepy little bastard. Good movie. 
Who remembers the jackal from 13 Ghosts? Doesn't exactly look like her, but is a super cool exhibit to have. I imagine she's not for sale either. These were in the last exhibit they had. Alex bought a bird skull. Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's right. Yeah, to go with it. Mm -hmm. To go with the other skull that he bought last time. Now, did you buy that last skull here? No, I bought it in Vegas. Oh, okay, okay. But Alex, there's something else Alex wanted me to show you over here. When I was growing up, when I went to the movies, I saw Star Wars, I wanted Star Wars toys. My kid wants a toy from the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. <laughs> That's just, who would have thought that they would make horror toys that you could buy and chase your little brothers and sisters around the house. I love the Mr. Museum. We come once a year. I wish we could come more. It's a chill place, especially if you love horror movies. And I can just come in here and hang out with the best of people. <laughs> All the stuff I'm showing you in this shop you can purchase, except for, of course, the really big displays that I was showing you in another room. Skulls, bugs, medical equipment. Yes, they sell medical equipment. My name's Cole. This is Cole, guys. He's gonna explain to me what this thing does. I wish I could. Oh, you don't know? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> well, I think it's electroshock therapy because it says electrocardiograph. Yeah. So maybe it's... Uh, it's some kind of antiquated... Maybe it's a, uh, maybe it's a, what's it called? A, um, a defibrillator, maybe? Maybe something it like could, that. Uh, maybe it is a defibrillator. I don't know. I'm not going to mess with it like <laughs> that. All I know is it's uh, pretty archaic. That's right. Um, you wanna, we can practice on you if you want to find out what it is. <laughs> if I show up to your house with my medical kit, don't worry. All is going to be fine. We're professionals. <laughs> all right, so we're going to do the museum. Um, next up, all you gotta do is pick out a superlative for your nickname on your ID. So we're picking out our IDs right now. I, I, I picked, uh, the hell is his name? Michael. Michael Myers. Damn, just totally forgot who he was. <laughs> and they, the women have picked Carrie and Alex picked Ghostface and now we get to pick out the superlative. Uh, killer classic. All right, so oh, that's a good one. I'll be the, no, you. I'll let the ladies pick first. And that is my 2024 Horror High Mystic Museum School ID. I am the horror role student. <laughs> Off to the museum we go. Oh, would you like to have that happen to you? Fun. Is that an arrow in your throat, or are you just happy to see me? Right, have it your way, because this is where your land of fiction gets away. We win and destroy. There's creepy things. not a stream or video killer at all. And into the exhibit we go. Horror High Reunion. Check out the chairs. Lindsay, you know what this is? I'm the snowflake queen. Who's the snowflake queen? Jennifer's body? That's what I thought. But I've never seen it, so I didn't know for sure. I don't get that. I don't get that either. Oh, Freddy.
Stab her! Stab her! Do it! Do it now! I didn't do it. I'm just kidding. I'm not either right now. Yeah, the last couple times we saw this, their exhibit was really, really good. This is a really cool room, though, that this is happening on. What happened? Are you going to smack my Oh, <laughs> Alex come behind me with a big ass hammer. Love the Freddy Krueger chairs. Totally want one of these. How come I'm getting Michelle vibes while I'm looking at this Freddy Krueger chair right here? What's even better is between the, or there's a hole in the glove, so you see Freddy Krueger's burned ass, melted skin, and then these gigantic blades. So Alex and Rosie have decided to go back to school. Rosie, fail. Alex, fail. Lindsay, fail. You all failed, all of you. You should be ashamed of yourselves. Get out of my class. This is happening outside our window. That was cool. Out of my seat! <laughs> You're looking a bit thin, and honestly, I'm concerned with your health. It's a really stupid stoner movie. Do you know what movie this is, Lindsay? We're debating. I have no clue. These high school movies these kids watch, other than Freddy Krueger, I don't know what this stuff is. What movie is this? Lindsay doesn't even know. He's wearing my t-shirt though. Just saying. If the Crypt Keeper were Carrie, or if Freddy was Carrie, this would probably be what it would be because there's a, a crown and I would think it's from the movie Carrie. I, I don't know. What's it say? Most like, oh, that's her, yeah. That's Lindsay, most likely to survive. Lindsay. Why don't you hop in there? Do I look like I can? <laughs> I think this is some sort of blood spatter. What I'm noticing in this display is one, it's half the size of the last display, same amount of money. Two, third, we don't have a chaperone this time. We've had a chaperone every time we've done these displays, but this time. Here's the actual carry scene right here. Yeah. She's a little tall, but she's gorgeous. It's about time you find a nice girl. It really, really is, yes. She likes to kill people. Yes. She'll fit in our family, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see what happens here. There's a sink here. Of course, my card's not working. Maybe I'm doing it wrong, hold on. You put your card on this thing right here. Oh, there it goes. And then there's a hole in the wall and all the spiders come out. Rosie loves spiders. I guess that's kind of cool. <laughs> oh. Need a hand? <laughs> it's part of the movie. Oh. So, one of their hands. Yeah. Like. Possessed? Yeah, it becomes possessed. Oh, okay. And you had a, he severed it. Threw it in the microwave. And cooked it. And it still stayed alive. Yes. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. I won't say it's separate. Not, not like, uh, what's his name's movie at all. Not like The Living Dead at all. This is obviously from that movie Jawbreaker. Rose McGowan. Look at the size of those. Quite sure I had this class. Hell, I might have taught that class. When your school curriculum is the Necronomicon. Oh, look. I wonder if the spells are in here. Holy shit, they are. Alex? That's what I was looking at earlier. This looks like some extra curricular activity at home later. Mm -hmm. Ladies, you want to play a game? <laughs> Too funny, the spells are actually in there for the movie. And it wasn't just one student's light reading because this student also has it with a magnifying glass.
Hmm. See? Why do you put the fridge in here if you're not supposed to pull the handle? I guess we're not supposed to pull it. I won't pull it, whatever. And we're out into the real world. That was a quick run through of the Mystic Museum. Been here a whole bunch of times. It's an awesome place to come. I will always come here and check out what they got going on, check out the new merch and look at the new displays they got inside the museum. But we're gonna head off now into Southern California, get our room, and we're gonna head on over to what we really, really came here for, which is in a totally different city. It's only about 30 minutes away, Long Beach, Midsummer Scream. There's gotta be something that she does. I just don't know where to do it at. Oh, you found it? Oh, there it is. Ha, 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 ha. 